Hi guys, welcome back to a new tutorial series of Java application development. From this part onwards, we will discuss about how to create some software components or how to build a software using Java. In the first part, we will discuss about how to we are going to learn about how to create a calculator in Java, a simple calculator in Java. I use the NetBeans IDE version 7.3 for the developing purpose and also using JDK 1.7. So now in this part, in this episode, we are going to start the development of a calculator using Java. We just create a calculator, same as a calculator available with your window your windows we are going to create a calculator much similar like this one using java now okay so now we are going to start that application development so go to the file option choose a new project say java category and choose the Java application project and click next you need to specify a project name I name it as my calculator I name it as my calculator and create main class option is present here make sure that which is unchecked we don't want a main class now and click finish now the IDE creates that project for us on the project explorer you can see a new project called my calculator is created two folders are present under that project a source package and a libraries on the source package you can see a default package is available on that source package of course on libraries there is the JDK files that means the library files available with Java 1.7 okay so let us again go to that calculator available with Windows so first we need to create the frame for that calculator you can see a frame is available with this calculator in that frame a close a closing button a maximize option actually it is disabled and a minimize option is present with that frame so we need to create a frame first so just right click your project name and choose on the new option choose the J frame form option and you need to specify a class name for that J frame I give it as main frame I name that class as main frame now you need to create a package here I create a new package called uh, calculator calculator okay fine now I click finish now you can see a new package is present a new package is created named the calculator and on that package there is a new class is created called the mainframe.java and here is the frame that we just created now and here is the design of that frame and on select the source option you can see the java code available with that frame you can see these are the java codes running behind that frame and choose the design option now here it is here is the design so now we need to create now we need to change the size size of this frame for matching a calculator so I am going to change the uh, size of this frame for compatible with a calculator okay now I just change you can change the size of this frame by using just uh, move the cursor over the edges you can you will get a option for changing the size 
just click the mouse and drag it you can change the you can change the size of that frame now I just change it for for a calculator application okay now I save it now before doing anything on this frame you need to run it you can check it by just uh, right click that file and choose the run file option now the project is now you can see a frame is launched now here is the calculator available with window and here is the calculator frame that we just recently created you can see that maximize option is disabled for this window application window calculator but in our in our case that is also uh, active that means you can maximize this window so I just click the maximize option you can see that that frame is actually maximized so now the next step you need to disable this option that means you need to disable the maximize option available with this frame so for that I just close it just right click that frame and choose the properties of that frame and here is an option called uh, resize okay here you can see an option called uh, resizable actually that is selected now now I make it as false I just uncheck it and close now I save the project again now I'm going to run it again now we got that frame and now you can see that that maximize option is now disabled in our application also okay now the user is not able to change the size of this calculator using using his mouse okay now we are going to place the user component GUA component on for our calculator okay before placing any component you need to specify you need to place a panel here panel on this frame so go to the palette window is present here if it is not present go to the window tab and choose the palette option here and from that palette window you can choose the panel option just click it and drag it into that frame I just place that panel in that frame and change the size of that panel as you wish I just change the size of that panel and just right click the properties of that panel here is the properties of the J panel properties and you can see here is a background option is present here now I just change the background color of that panel and click OK and close now we can now it's possible to verify that frame and panel okay now I just save it and again run it okay now you can see the frame is also associated with a panel now I have to change the size of that panel again okay now it's fine guys that's enough for this part please go to the next part of this tutorial. Thank you for watching. See you in the next part.